Good morning, guys. Guess what? It's like legitimately morning. Like, it's like 8.25. Like, legit morning. And since it's legit morning, I'm making myself tea. I need it. And that's gonna be good. It's English breakfast. Um, my hair has gotten longer than I ever expected it to. It's like back in the air now. That's cool. I'm excited. Um, yep, so we're up, guys. We're going to go to the New Hampshire League of Craftsmen craft fair thing. That'll be interesting. I have no idea what to expect or what it'll be like. So that'll be fun. Yep. Um, it's a nice day outside. Just the camera. Look, it's the camera. Yeah, it's like blue skies and stuff. You just can't tell. There aren't really any clouds, which is kind of interesting. There have been clouds past couple of days. Oh. Hey guys, we are at the craft fair. In the food area. Look, there's craft fair over there that you can't see. And there's craft fair over there that you kind of can see. And there are a lot of older people here. A lot of like blown glass and handmade stuff that I don't want to buy because I don't want any of it. And now we're just sitting here in the food tent waiting for parents to come so we can eat. Which they're not doing. What? Which they're not doing. Which they're not doing, yeah. And, yep, so that's what's happening. It rained earlier and then we had to like run through the rain to get here because they were like, Okay, get there, and then they were, it was, we've been sitting here for a while, waiting to eat, and they haven't come yet, and that's bothersome. And you know, we could right just now. drive away, never mind. And we're just sitting next to all Or we could just order um, food and then make them taste back. That would work. Um, yeah, I mean, there's pretty stuff here, I just don't want to buy any of it, it's not really my style or anything. I hope you can hear me right now. Guys, but first of all, it's raining outside. Okay, second of all, the, the thing about who the next doctor is supposed to be has started, and I just want them to announce who the next doctor is, and they haven't yet. They're 13 minutes into the cast, and I'm watching a, like, it's a live thing that they're updating with, like, texts of what's happening on it. Because I don't get BBC America here because I don't have TV in this housey thing and I just want to know who the next doctor is and it's things like, I mean, uh, oh, I just, I don't care. I just want to, I just want to know who the next doctor is. And it's really upsetting. I just, I just want to know guys. Why can't they just tell me? Uh. <sighs> While I'm waiting to find out. So yeah, that was the craft fair. Um, I'm fine. Um, yeah. And there was a lot of, I mean, like, there was pretty stuff. It was, like, all handmade. And the people who are vendors there, they get judged. So you have to get basically, like, chosen to be a part of that craft fair. So it's, like, it's really, like, yeah. It's a big thing. And, um, yeah, so you have to get chosen. Um, so like, I mean, there's a bunch of beautiful stuff, like, I mean, they have gorgeous handmade jewelry that's made of, like, silver and gold and rocks and all that, but, like, there are a lot of middle-aged to old people there, and that's not really the kind of stuff I want. Um, it doesn't say anything new yet. Um, and, yeah, and, I mean, like, there were handmade leather things, and there were hand crochet things and handmade wool things and all that that's just not really my style of looks like it's a male at least talk to you he him Sheridan Smith was the most right actress so we can presume she's not I don't care who's not gonna be it okay um yeah um so yeah I mean it was nice but then it like kept raining and got cold and then so we like the parents wanted to wander through more so like after we were sitting there for a while waiting for them for lunch we sat there for longer just ate ice cream because we didn't really have anything else to do 
Um, yeah, so I mean like it was cool and stuff and I guess I'm glad I went once but I don't think I need to go again. Um, yeah, also a lot of it was really expensive. Like kind of ridiculously expensive. Um, but I mean like it's handmade stuff so I understand that but whatever and I just want to know who the new doctor is. struggles. It's Peter Capaldi like they all thought it was gonna be. Okay, okay now I know who the next doctor is and I'm just gonna go and stalk him on the interwebs now. So I feel a lot better. Everything's okay now. Hmm. It's a video for Mumford and Sons Hopeless Wanderer also just came out and I just watched it and not gonna lie it was kind of great. <laughs> If you guys haven't watched it yet, you should, because I think it's wonderful. Kind of odd, but kind of wonderful. Hey, so since that, um, as you know, we got back from the craft fair. I was here for a while, and then Tori came over and she hung out with us, and then had dinner with us, and then continued to hang out with us, because, you know, just to get in some more time with her. Um, she had, like, leftovers for dinner and stuff, and... So she hung out with us for a while, we kind of did her own thing for a little bit, and then we watched, started watching Pitch Perfect, we didn't finish it. Um, and my mom and Linnea just left with Tori because we were borrowing a car from the ashes, so we needed to return it, so we were taking two cars over to drop off Tori and then one car back, so mom and Lydia had to drive. Um, so that's the last time I'll see Tori, um, until next year, pretty much. Um, which is, you know, kind of sad or whatever, I mean, like, I really like her, we've been pretty close and stuff. Um... Yeah, and I'm just going to continue watching Once Upon a Time. So I'm on the last episode, and stuff's going down. I'm probably going to make myself some tea, make my ending video, edit this, try to watch Doctor Who, probably try to do more AP stat, and start packing and stuff. Because we're driving up to New York tomorrow. So, that's where I'm at. It's just, trip is ending. That's for sure. And I have a college interview tomorrow. Oh my god, guys. <laughs> That's kind of terrifying. Um, yeah. <sighs> Gotta go look up stuff about Skidmore so I can tell them why I want to go to Skidmore. But, oh my god, just... Uh, the future's happening. What? When did that start going on? I don't know. I don't know. Hey guys, so I'm waiting for my tea to cool. So I have extra milk, because I got it in these little cups because like there isn't any in here. And so I got to my grandma's house, like extra milk and extra sugar, and I was like, oh, I don't know what to do with them. So then I was like, I'm smart, I'm gonna combine them and then drink it. So I'm gonna do that. So here we go, there's milk, there's sugar. And that goes, I don't even know if there's enough milk to soak it up. It's gonna be terrible. I have no idea if there's enough milk to do We're just going to do that. Can we call that good? Put a spoon and stir it, maybe? That's not going to do much. Oh, God. Well, for your viewing pleasure, I chug a tiny... Can you even see that? Yeah, you can see that. Okay. I chug a tiny bit of really sugary milk. Yeah, that's not good. That is, mm, 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 mm. That's weird. That's just freaking. no. That's just, uh-uh, that ain't good. These two do not go together very well just by themselves. You can bake things with them, sure, but can't just, can't just make them. Ugh. Hey guys, it's our little Little ending, ooh, ooh. getting through some things. Little ending time. Made myself more tea. Oh, also, I'm having alfredo at what time is it? 9:32 at night. Because I had extra from when we went to Mickey's, and I didn't want to just leave it in the fridge forever because then it would get nasty. So I microwaved it, and now I'm eating that as well. Although I already started eating some of it. So 
there's not a lot left. But yeah. So, um, today was kind of chill. I mean, like, going to the craft fair was, like, it was fun and everything, but it wasn't really all that into it. Like, I mean, it just wasn't really applicable to me. Like, my mom bought a purse and she bought something for grandma there. And that's great, but not really stuff that I would use or wear or anything. So, it took, like, me and Lydia and Tori, like, half an hour to go through all of it. That's really big. I mean, it's supposed to be like really like good stuff because people have to like there's a jury that basically judges you and decides whether or not you're good enough to be in the craft fair um so it's like a big thing but like so everything was good quality and everything and just it wasn't really my type of thing um but whatever Got to hang out with Lydia and Tori, although they spent, although they spent a lot of time on their iPhone, so I'm just like, la dee da dee da dee da dee da That's okay. Um, yeah, everything's just kind of wrapping up, and we're going to New York tomorrow. And that's great. I still gotta look up stuff about Skidmore. I wanted to just watch Doctor Who. My life is so hard. Um, and we're having dinner with Lydia's friend, Abby's family, and Abby's the one whose father Lydia is shadowing, apparently I'm going to a nice place, and I brought my mustard yellow blazers, I'm going to get to where they at. I'm excited. Um, yeah, but that's about all that's been happening. It was kind of nice to just kind of like chill with Lydia and Tori and stuff afterwards. That was kind of cool. Um. But yeah, that's about all that's been going on. I still got a pack. I need to go get my laundry out of the dryer. Um, yeah. Oh yeah, there's like a little garage area that you've seen like briefly. Cause I think you've seen me go through it, but not. I don't know. There's nothing in there. It's a large garage. I mean, whatever. Um, yeah. Um, that's all that's been going on. <sighs> yeah. So I love you guys. It was nice to talk to you, Mario. That was, yeah, that was, oh, I was going to call you for the night. I will do that. I will call you. You probably already have talked to me by the time you see this. That's okay. Um, yeah, so I will love you guys, miss you, and I will see you tomorrow.